You've probably heard a lot recently about the reported health benefits of coconut oil. It is a hot product now. So it was nice to hear that a homegrown company in Tampa is on the cutting edge of this fast-growing business. These are just three of our products, um, our 14 ounce, our 8 ounce, and our pre-measured baking sticks. Erin Meeker, barely 30 years old, is a true believer in the future of coconut oil. Coconut oil sales are outpacing olive oil sales right now. The stylish former teacher at Osceola High School found her calling in 2009, just as reports of the healthful properties of coconut oil were making the news. I was teaching entrepreneurship, and then I was passionate about it, and then I found my product, the coconut oil, that I believed in 100%, I could get behind, and then I went and I did it. Last year, Meager's fledgling startup sold $3 million worth of Calipo extra virgin coconut oil across the country. She sources the organic free trade oil from Sri Lanka, which explains the elephant logo. And she's proud to be the young job creator the Bay Area so desperately seeks to attract and keep. We have five employees now in our office here. Um, we're trying to create those jobs that will create the sense that young people do want to live and work in Tampa Bay, like we do. Meager's been successful in getting her product on the shelves of major chains like Whole Foods and Publix, along with smaller grocers like Roll and Oats in Tampa where even the manager uses the product. And I actually do it in smoothies and if I'm sautéing even. Do people ever just Down the hatch? snork it right out of the jar? Yeah. <laughs> it is surprisingly light with just a hint of coconut flavor. Meager hopes the sweet smell of success will inspire other young entrepreneurs. I think that's really important that they kind of chase their dreams of whatever it is because um, that's what makes America great, right? Well, Erin Meager was able to find a key investor to fund her startup three years ago, and she has plans for an ambitious but gradual expansion of her company.